What up, what up, YouTube? About to do a juicy video. Let's get into it. I ain't juiced in like, man, it's been a minute. It's been about three weeks, man, since I had actual juice. But this is blending. I'm, I'm just blending right here, though. You know, this ain't no juice, and I'm just blending. But I ate it. It's just like a smoothie. It is what it is, though. Better than nothing. You know what I'm saying? This is better than nothing. Instead of eating all that fast food every day, man, you know. I get tired of doing that. Eating chips and beers and burgers and all that junk. Yeah. Put the light on. Strawberries in forever, yo. So this would be good. Strawberries, blood, orange, lemon, and lime. Yeah. It's light. It's pretty dark in here. Flick the light on. feel good throughout the day after this right here, man. And get a big lemon. You can tell they injected that, yo. Look how big a lemon is compared to uh, this. It's crazy. Or compared to this one. This is a whole, this is a jumbo lemon. I'm going to save this because this is pretty, you get a lot of Fruit after that, you know, out, out of this. I said after that, but after um, out of this, you get a lot of juice. So I'm just going to use a small one. Uh, these have already been washed and, and uh, freezed and everything. So these are good to go. I really don't wash my, I mean, a lot of people do. They wash their oranges and uh, lemons and stuff like that before they eat them. But, I mean, shoot. I mean, it really don't matter to me, yo. It is what it is. I mean, I know it's parasites and stuff that uh, swarm in these type of fruits and stuff. But, you know, especially, especially, especially these uh, acidic fruits like a lime, orange, and a lemon. A lot of parasites dwell in these type of fruits because, you know, you know it's, it's a survival haven for them. So I guess that you could say, you know. You know, uh, pretty sweet. You know what I'm saying? They're pretty sweet, pretty tasty. And, uh, shoot, it is what it is. I mean, even if you're washing them, you're still not going to get all the parasites out of them. You know, you can have to deep freeze them or whatever. And well, I ain't got time for all that, yo. Yo, I'd rather put these damn parasites in my body from this in here and these oranges and stuff than keep on eating that parasite ass 
uh, meat, that burger and that, that uh, uh, ham and all that garbage. So, oh well. Let's try to find a knife I can cut with. We got a good one today. Okay. Cutting board. And uh, strawberries already, like I said, been froze or whatever and chopped up. Good to go. Smell good. I right, say so it's three. Let's see. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. I'm gonna do ten. Ten. Um, I parasites live in the uh, strawberries too. I'm missing anything though, man. Yeah. Yeah. It's a good day today, man. It's, you know. Blood orange is any good. Yeah, all that blood that came out. <laughs> That's what she said. <laughs> yeah. Ew. Yeah. A lot of dudes, man, they be they be they be quick to tear the chick up on the, on the you know what I'm saying? When she's bloody. I can't do it, man. I ain't that freak. I'm a freak. I'm freaky as hell, man. But I can't do the blood, man. You know. A lot of these dudes out here, man, they don't give a damn. They don't give a, it's, it's clean, bloody, smelling good. You know what I'm saying? They ready to hop in whatever out here, man. They just want to say they got some. You know what I'm saying? I ain't jumping in no blood, dog. You know? Hell no. I almost did. One time, man, I was so goddamn, I was so turned on, man. I, I didn't even give a damn, dog, if it was bloody in that shit. You know what I'm saying? Them shits, man. I wasn't even, I wasn't even tripping, dog. I was just ready to go. You know what I'm saying? I was holding my goddamn seed for so damn long, man. You know. I'm on fourth day no fat right here, man. You know, right here, I'm on fourth day. Then, that time, I don't know, I think I was, I was probably up three days, man. I thought that was a long time to go without busting, you know what I'm saying? That's when I really started getting on my no-fap shit. I was just, I was so turned on, man. I'm like, shit, I'm trying to get in some, you know what I'm saying? So, you know, my, my beautiful female, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. It was that time of the month, but I was ready to go in anyway. I wasn't really tripping about it. I was like, come on, baby. You know, let's get it in. You know, I kind of went in for a little bit. I came right back out. I'm like, nah, I can't do this shit. Because <laughs> I, I had smoked some weed, too. I was high and shit. But you know, you high and shit, man. You get, you got the, you got a major urge to just go in, man, on shit. You know what I'm saying? You don't even think about it. Like, you're just ready to go. But, nah, I ain't never, I ain't never touching that, man. No, not that bloody shit, man. You know what I'm saying? Nah. That ain't my thing. Shout out to some of you fools out there that, that, that's down for that, though. Go ahead, man. Good, best, best wishes to you, man. But, not Blake. Blake ain't, ain't going down for that, man. Yeah, I'm about to get a cam, man. I'm about to get a camera. Because this shit, man, it's, it's getting old. You know, I got a new phone right now, whatever, and it's recording pretty good, you know, a long time. But I did get a cam, man, that I can record all day, like, do all type of different videos and, 
you know, challenges or whatever, do all types of stuff, man. No fap challenges, you know what I'm saying? Record it, you know, document it, you know, document it, post it up. You know, shoot. It feels good to get back on YouTube, man. I haven't been on here for a minute and just did a, a video, you know. It feels good. Like, even though nobody really watches my shit, but still, you know, I mean, it's still fun, man. I enjoy it, man. It ain't even bad all that, you know, all the time. Just, I like speaking my mind. I like, you know, spilling my thoughts on, you know, on camera or whatever. So, It's going to be a good juice, hopefully. Sunny outside, man. Still look cold, you know. It was real cold yesterday. It, was, it snowed last night. Like, I'm like, damn, it's spring and snowing. Like, people was like, you know, people was shocked. Like, man, how's it snowing? You know what I'm saying? It's spring. You know, probably you saying, you know, we in the Midwest, you know, I'm in, I'm in the Ville, so. You know, but, I mean, anything's possible, yo, you know. You know. Shit, you think weather ain't getting controlled out here? That's getting controlled, too. Everything's everything's under control out here, man, in this world, man. You know what I'm saying? From the, you know, the, from the temperature to the water supply, you know, everything's being controlled. Everything's being Tampered with, with, manipulated, you know what I'm saying? Uh, everything, man, you know, you just can't, ain't nothing pure no more, you know? Like, I was telling my old lady, man, you know, back in the day, you know, that way, 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 way back in the day, people could probably, you know, hold on me. You know, people was talking about, like, like, it's a lot of YouTubers that talk about, like, washing their hair and the rainwater and, the rainwater's healthy for your hair, man. I mean, back in the day, you could, you know, washing the shit, like, you could wash and, 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 and take baths and wash your hair and, 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 and drink the shit. Like, it was that pure, probably, you know what I'm saying? And then just after a while, the shit started getting tampered with, you know what I'm saying? Just, you know, all the poisons and toxins and shit they put out here on the earth, man. On this beautiful planet, they, you know, humans destroy shit, so... You know, they didn't fuck the rainwater up, you know. And, you know, got a chemical as soon as that rainwater hits and it evaporates back up to the, you know. And uh, it's getting, it's just absorbing all those toxins, man. It's getting all those toxins up in it. And it's not pure. It's not safe to, to drink. It's not safe to wash your hair with. It's like nothing's pure out here no more, you know. I don't know too much about none of it. No, you know what I'm saying? I'm not a, no, a weather man or nothing like that, but I just assume, you know, I'm always making assumptions, man, you know, because us as humans, you know, we think we know it all, but we don't know shit at all. Like, we don't know nothing. You know, we don't know nothing, yo. That's what's wrong with people. People always want to correct somebody. It's like, you don't know, man. You, we get not information from books, you know what I'm saying? We don't know who wrote the shits. We get not information from the news. We don't know, you know, they uh, kind of lies and shit spread, man, through the news station and media, man. Like, you can't believe everything, man. man. You can't believe, you can't believe shit, for real. You can't believe shit, for real, man. So, I mean, it's just, that's the hard thing, man. You you don't know what the hell is, is real and what's, what's fake out here, you know? It's just hard to determine, you know, even, even through people, you know, you, see, you know, it's a lot of people that I talk to, you know, on a day to day basis and out here in the world. And, you know, they seem happy. They seem like good people. They seem legit, but you don't know what their intentions are. You know what I'm saying? At the end of the day, you know, everybody that's smiling your face ain't your friend, man. You know, everybody that smoke a blunt with you ain't going to ain't going to. You know, just because they roll a blunt with you don't mean they're going to roll for you, you know, to the end. You know what I'm saying? So, you know, and, you know, I've always had, like, people I was close to, you know, I feel like that I cut off. You know what I'm saying? I feel bad. You know, it probably makes me a bad person. You know, people probably say, ah, oh, the nigga Blake, that nigga fake, that nigga ain't real. You know what I'm saying? 
But, man, I'm trying to get on my shit, you know what I'm saying? I'm trying to focus on me, man, you know. Shouts out to you, man, you know, whatever. You know, whoever I, I, I cut off or whatever in this life, man. I mean, we still cool, man, you know. I don't have no beef with nobody out here in the world, like nothing. Like, I have no ill will in my heart for nobody, man, you know. I just want to take that positive positivity, positivity with me, like, everywhere I go, man. And, you know. It is what it is, man. I mean, you know, maybe I'm just focused on something else, man. You know, I'm no better than no, nobody's better than nobody out here, you know. But it comes a point in time where man and woman has to focus on them. Even if you're in a relationship, even if you're with your homegirls, even if, even if you're with your niggas, you still got to focus on your shit, man. You still got to get your shit together. You know what I'm saying? So... It ain't no it ain't about nobody turning on each other, none of that, man. It's just about you handling your shit, man. You know what I'm saying? I mean, everybody got their own route in this life. You know, you gotta you gotta think about it like that. Some people work, some people do YouTube, some people do uh clothing lines, some people do restaurant businesses, you know, some people some people study shit and, and, and pick up on knowledge and learn, man. Some people go on get their money from game shows, you know. Uh, some people fix on bikes. Some people work on cars. You know, uh, you know. Some people work, like I said. Some people work a nine to five. Some people got their own shit running, their own business. Some people rap. Some people cut hair. Some people put shit together. Some people build. You know, everybody got their own thing they doing, man. You can't knock a, you can't knock a motherfucker for doing him, man. For for doing what he love to do. You know, even if I'm like I never I never talk down on people, man, because. You know, whatever they love, they love, man. And even if they ain't getting paid for the shit, man, I'm, I'm happy for them, man. Because they're doing what the fuck they love to do, man. As long as you're doing what the fuck you love to do every day when you wake up. That's, that's all that matters, yo. You, That's legit. You know, that's legit. But I don't ever like, ah, man, you stop doing like. Stop writing, you know what I'm saying? You ain't getting paid for this shit, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, you know. Stop drawing, man. This shit ain't paying off, you know. I don't never never be quick like that, man, to judge me. Cause you don't know what the hell'll come out of a you don't know what the hell'll come out of a rainbow, man. The darkest freaking I I mean I said rainbow. You don't know what the hell will come out of a thunderstorm, yo. The darkest fucking thunderstorm. Uh, uh, uh create the most beautiful, brightest rainbow you ever want to see, yo. The darkest guy the darkest thunderstorm, man, that comes your way, that's in the city. The dark. It could be pitch black outside, thunderstorm, wind blowing, trees getting knocked down, tornado swirling. After that, a beautiful rainbow is going to come after that. That's what's going to happen, man. That's what happens. Through the darkness comes the light. Comes something beautiful after that, man. So you got to go through it. You got to go through this, the, the, the tornado swirls. You got to go, go through the hurricanes, the, the, the tsunamis. You got to go through that, man. In order to get to that rainbow. But, you know, people want to be so quick to judge. They don't want to go through the process of going through shit so they can get to the rainbow. They just want the rainbow automatically. It don't work like that, yo. You got to struggle, man. You got you to go through nights and go through grinds where you don't get paid for what you love doing. It's going to eventually pay off. And that's what I believe in my heart. It's going to eventually pay off sooner or later if I just keep pushing on. Yeah. Got the alkaline shits, man. Alkaline shit. Yeah. Shoot, shoot, shoot. Put a little bit more. You know, they say, you know, water uh, don't you don't drink out of water bottles. It's 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 no good for you. You know. Ain't nothing's good for you, yo. But It is what it is. Let's get this juicing going on the road, man. Blat out. Put a napkin up over it so this stuff don't explode everywhere. That's what she said. <laughs> Ready to go. Five, four, three, two, one. We got action. <laughs> Let this one for 
about five to ten minutes sometimes. <laughs> Probably ain't done yet, but just gonna get a taste of it. <laughs> Cheers. I ain't put no veggies in it. Not today. <laughs> you know, another thing, man. Let me see. I'm almost done. With it. You know, the 420 thing, man, you know. I don't knock nothing, man. You know, I don't knock it because I love we. I love marijuana just next to the next and the next man and woman. You know what I'm saying? Uh, marijuana's cool, man. It's good. I love to smoke. I love to get high. I love to chill and relax with it and be creative while I'm writing my music and stuff with it and, and recording in the studio, or whatever. But you know, people abuse it, man. They abuse the substance to the point where, man, they can't not. You know, they they can't uh, uh, do too much. On a day to day basis, they so lazy and so high off the shits. So like, you know, you gotta slow down, yo. You know, you gotta slow down. You know, um, you know, this is really all the, this is all the highness you need right here, man. This juice, man. Just, you know, uh, blending, juicing, whatever you wanna call us, man. This is blending, you know, this is a blend, it's not a juicer. Um, but I had a juicer, I got a juicer to, you know, uh, you're not going to get into that right now, but I'll be juicing on uh, some days. And, uh, but this is all you really need right here, man. This will get you high, man. This is, this is high on life. This is stuff right here. You put this in your system. This going to do you justice, man. This going to, this going to keep you healthy. Keep you, keep you thin, man. 
you know, keep you fit, man. Keep you on your on your toes, man. Keep you agile. Keep you fast. Keep you focused. Laser focus. Eye contact. You know, focused on your mission, man. You know, and uh, this is all you need right here. days, man. No fat, man. Similar retention. I got a lot of energy, yo. And it's going to boost it up. It's going to build that semen up, too, yo. Like, it's really going to build that semen up, man. Putting this healthy stuff in your system. It's really build the semen up, you know. Mmm. Mmm. It's it. It's it right here. Last cup, man. So. It's a lot, man, because I put a lot. I put a lot more than I should have put it in there. It's a lot. It's a lot to be drinking. Mm, feeling good, yo. That's it. That's the blending video. Me getting right. Uh, you can try this at home. I'm out of breath. Oh, uh, man. Yeah. Take a sip of dang, the water's gone. But, um, uh, on to the next video, yo. It's Blake the Matchbox, Blake the Spider Form, Blake the Mike Spiegel, Blake the Mike Mugan, whatever you want to call him, as long as you put the Blake B for red. Bang! On to the next one, yo. One love. Stay safe. Stay healthy. Stay out the way. Keep positive. See you in the next one, yo. One love. I'm out. Bang.